Now, staying on with Omicron. UK continues to remain one of the worst affected countries due to the ongoing Omicron outbreak. Authorities have now stepped up measures to stem the crisis. However, amid this growing surge in cases, a latest study on hospitalizations rate due to the Omicron strain has offered fresh hope. Now, according to UK Health Secretary Agency, people infected with Omicron are less likely to require hospital treatment compared to patients who have contracted the Delta variant. Now, as per the latest data, the risk of hospitalization with the Omicron variant is about one-third to that of the Delta variant, which means if someone does get infected with the Omicron strain, they are less likely to get seriously ill. Now, this comes at a time when Britain is experiencing a massive surge in COVID cases, driven by the highly transmissible Omicron variant. Now, the UK Health Secretary reported a record daily surge of over 189,800 cases on Friday. While hospital admissions have started to rise, experts claim that the new variant is milder than the Delta strain. This, as the number of patients needing mechanical ventilation beds has also remained steady through December. Now, unlike previous peaks in the pandemic, the study has analysed over 528,000 Omicron cases and 573,000 Delta cases from the period of November 22nd to December 26th in England. It has also shared efficacy of booster doses. Now, according to the UK study, booster doses, doses significantly increase protection and are 88% effective at preventing COVID-related hospitalization. Now, the latest study comes just weeks after London's Imperial College published a similar research on the need of hospitalization for Omicron cases. The study says the risk of hospitalization for Omicron patients is 40 to 45% lower than for patients infected with the Delta variant.